Ready? Born ready. All right, y'all. Got a uh, just react. This is our uh, show where we react to the things that we see online. Probably didn't have time to get to it on the podcast. Uh, so. Uh, more content, more content. More content, more, more content. content more I don't know content. if this is going to be Patreon or YouTube, but we'll, we'll let y'all decide. We'll, we'll go from there. So, uh, who we got with us today? Uh, today we got that boy, Cozy. Cozy JJ. No, JJ the on. shoe man. JJ yeah. from State Farm. Hey. JJ. JJ from Who Gave on Boys. I ain't a business man, but I'm a business man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hold on, you said that wrong. I so did. <laughs> <laughs> I think you said I ain't a business man, but I'm a business man. <laughs> Hey man, uh, boy fourth the who gave them boys a pie. What's up, JJ? How you feeling? Hey man, I'm feeling good. Blessed man, blessed to do this with y'all, man. I'm excited. I'm excited. Yeah. So it ain't nothing. It's just give us your reaction when you see this video. Watch it. We gonna put it on screen. You tell us what you think. Oh, for sure. Right, for right. sure. Right. You on the screen? Let's get it. Into these characters right. for longer yeah, period. periods of, mm-hmm. of time, and it's just the weight of this mm-hmm. story, the weight of these experiences. The quality of the actors. Yeah. You're talking about emancipation. It was physically, it was spiritually taxing. One of the first days on set, there was a scene with one of the actors. He leans down in my face and says, you're a cold one, ain't you? And then he ad-libbed. Hell no. I was like. (laughs) Uh. I was like, make up! <laughs> right? No, but it was Ooh, like. You told me about that. I was like, whoa. Every actor on this set was taking it really, Real. taking it seriously. really serious. So, um, <laughs> so I know this supposed to be first reaction. This is actually my second reaction to watching. First time watching this version. So, this is what pissed me off about this. He's telling this story in multiple locations. He received an award and he told this on stage. And on stage, she went into detail of how this actor did it multiple times. First time he did it, and he did that same little, ooh, that little gay whale yeah, person. That, that was real feminine. It, anytime Will does his hands like this, now it's the gay whale. Yeah, before it used to be the Fresh Prince funny wheel. Now yeah. it's the gay whale. Yeah, and it's a little, it's a little zesty. It's, a little <laughs> yeah, zesty. it's definitely zesty. <laughs> so, so, come on, man. Like, you went from being the dude that just slapped Chris Rock for a joke, slapped this dude on pay a brother, in on public national TV. Now you on set, which you're the superstar, you the head person in charge. Anybody know Will Smith? If he if it's his movie, it's his movie. So you can cut, you can do. Ain't no director gonna tell will smith he can't cut you know what i'm saying mm. no director ain't gonna tell will smith he can't do mm. whatever he want to do so in your space a no and then it's a no name actor because you didn't say a name mm-hmm. if it would have been someone like, was trying to protect his face nah, nah. It, it was a no name i ain't even seen the movie and i'm pretty sure it's a no name a no name actor doing that to will smith is crazy a no name white boy spit on this man and you sit here like if he tell the story on stage he says he took it two times and then the director was like hey let's try that one more time without the spit and then we were like that's when i knew there's a god and i found we lost him i I feel like he lost him listen yeah he definitely lost watch watch this one watch this one 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 of the, the white actors and we we had our line and uh, the actor uh, decided to, to ad lib. Um, so we're doing the scene. Oh, we got to send it back. I told him send that back there. <laughs> and then uh, he did his line. Hell no. And then he ad libbed and spit. In the middle of my he done practice how to spit without spit. I, I was just, bro, why are you <laughs> yeah. to the words out of my mouth? Bro? I was just like, yeah. Mm-hmm. I ain't making that. See, this? look, he, look, he, look, look, look. If I had pearls on, I would have clutched on it. Like, what? Come on. And I wanted to say Antoine. <laughs> Antoine is the director. Antoine Fuqua. Antoine. Training day. 
That's why. But I stopped and I realized that Peter couldn't have called the director. Man, all those, <laughs> I had a positive, all those stupid ass people in the crowd was mm. <laughs> Fuck that. What That's why fuck? people respond to slavery and they didn't know what to say. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he just was the second time. Take two. And the uh, actor felt that the ad lib had gone well. <laughs> <laughs> so we do take two. I do my line, <laughs> and he does his line, and spits in the middle of my chest again. And he don't he don't practice this story. That's how you know this show. There was a part. It makes me teary right now, right? And there was a part of me that was grateful, yeah. right? That I got to really. Understand. Be right? grateful for that white man spit yeah. on you. That's crazy. In the distance, I hear a voice, and Antoine says, "Hey, let's do a take without the spit." <laughs> <laughs> and in that moment, I knew that God was real. <laughs> So he felt the power and the urge to smack Chris Rock in front of the whole world, but then feel the urge to tell a white man to, to not. He, spit he didn't say stop spit. He was grateful for the spit. Like grateful for it, bro. That's, uh, that's ridiculous. And and the fact that he don't practice this story, the way he don't practice this story, let me know. This is like a part. It's a bit. Yeah, it's a bit now. You know what I'm saying? Like, because well, I was, of, it's I part was, of his redemption. I feel like too. It's like. You know, it's like let, let let's humanize Will. Let's the because I ain't gonna lie, I had no interest in seeing this movie. Yeah, I never seen it. I, I still don't, but it sparked a little. Like it's like I, him doing this and I, talking about I feel it. Like it's just another slave movie. That's I, what I'm saying. I'm not gonna watch. It, I don't maybe. even think it's another slave movie. I think it's a Will Smith slave movie. Yeah, <laughs> which is worse. Because <laughs> he, yeah. he gonna pander. Yeah, this is an example of that. You know what I'm saying? And I I just hate. Cause you know, uh, Chris Rock came back and responded, and this is actually people mad at Chris Rock uh, because be because he did the story, the uh, the uh, the set. One, you know, I commend him for being able to wait that long to do it. Yeah, that's that's the genius part. Like this dude waited a whole fucking year to tell his side, and he got paid to tell it. But uh, two, Will Smith, somehow, I wish he could just get over it. I think he is over. It. I don't think. I don't think. Chris Rock mad. I think he did what he did. He just made a smart business decision and capitalized on Yeah, off of I think he's over. I don't think Chris Rock losing sleep over this shit. But he had to make it seem like he wasn't <clears> over <throat> it in order for like for the build the effect. But this right here, I don't know what it's worth. I first time I seen it was the award show, but I think it's worth watching him tell his kids. Ain't no yeah. way I'm telling my kids that yeah, I got I, spit on I, by the white man. So but you gotta were, think about who his kids is though. No, I can tell by his laugh how they laughing. Who his kids? Is. Yeah, that was that was, that was a fake ass laugh. Um, cause I, I know when my kids be doing that fake laugh to me. <laughs> I like, oh nigga, that shit wasn't. Like, y'all, y'all just trying to get something from me, like y'all. Yeah, that was one Christmas too. time. Yeah, exactly, Quasi. And then you, uh, <laughs> you already had sent me the award one. Yeah. I didn't know he. First of all, I didn't know he took over Red Table. Like, where was Jada? And then, yeah. <laughs> and then oh I didn't know he told. Let's not talk like, about later. Yeah, I didn't know he told the kids that. So now I'm kind of interested in seeing what was the whole talk on this red table. Like, would you set your kids down and talk about your mama being called a bitch? 